What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. So as the thumbnail says it all, we've got some bad and I would say rather disappointing news around Battlefield 2042. We've got a blog post from Byron Beat, the general manager in Battlefield. And the news is simply season seven will be the end of seasons for Battlefield 2042. It was something that we all had coming. It was obvious that they have to st stop all this somewhere and change the focus to like the next Battlefield game that's coming out in 2025. Uh, but now season seven is going to be that season and they've officially announced that this thing is going to happen. We also know that Motive Studio, as DICE wants to call them, the talented developers known most recently for their work on the critically acclaimed remake of Dead Space and Star Wars Squadrons, are building a team focused on Battlefield at their studio. So they are joining on board for the next Battlefield game as well. Um, so that's basically the two news that we've got. This is, I wouldn't say some great news, but it's better than nothing. But the majority of this is just disappointing. Things will be just harder and harder for... 2042 creators. So with all that said, that is what we're going to talk about today. Uh, I'm going to read the blog post. We're going to go through uh, what they have to say about this whole thing. And that's going to be it. If you enjoyed the content and found this information helpful, do make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel as well, because we'll be covering Battlefield 2042 news and the news around the next Battlefield game that's coming out in 2025. So if you want to be informed about all of those things, you better subscribe to the channel. So let's get right into the video to see what we've got. Uh, the blog post, the link to it is down in the description. So you guys want to Check it out. The link is there. But the title is an update on Battlefield 2042 and welcoming Motive Studio to the team. So they're basically expanding the team. So this is how the blog post basically starts. I'm going to read the important parts. When Battlefield 2042 launched, we promised to bring four seasons of content to the game, including new maps, additional specialists, weapons, vehicles, and more. As our seasons continued, the feedback we received made it clear our appetite for more Battlefield 2042 remained strong. We took the opportunity to evolve the game to make it even better for you and continue to learn valuable lessons for our own developmental processes. Last month, we released the seventh season of Battlefield 2042 Turning Point, which added an intense new urban map set in Chile, as well as several weapons. I mean, come on, man, like several weapons. So you didn't basically add several weapons. I mean, a bit of honesty wouldn't hurt, you know? It wasn't several weapons, it was just two weapons and a new gadget, and that's all. Anyway, apparently DICE can't really be honest anymore. While we've enjoyed and are proud of creating these seasons of additional content for Battlefield 2042, it is now necessary for us to turn from the present to the future. What this ultimately means is that Season 7 will serve as the final season for Battlefield 2042. After Season 7 concludes, we will continue to support the game with new in-game challenges, events, modes, and of course, ongoing maintenance, but we are moving away from delivering official seasons. We know this news may be disappointing, it actually is, however, as we looked at what the future of these series required, it became clear it was time for us to shift our resources and focus to be fully dedicated to what comes next. As I've mentioned before in previous updates, we have an ambitious vision to embrace and unlock the vast potential of the series, class-based squad play and immersive, intense battles. And, and then basically he continues uh, welcoming Motive Studio on board. That's about the blog post itself. But as I said, I believe we had it coming. It was like season seven or ultimately season eight. That could have been the end of Battlefield 2042 because we knew that the next Battlefield game is going to be released in 2025. So this should have happened, you know, sooner or later. Season 7 did not provide that much for this news to not be disappointing and to be actually satisfying because we knew that they're shifting focus to the new game. You know, we already faced lack of content in 2042. And now with whatever's happening and all the studios that are working on the new Battlefield, it's good to shift focus to something that's coming in a year, but the brutal fact here is that Battlefield 2042 is going to be left without new content for at least a year. And that is just shocking to say the least, because in the past three years, the game has always been lacking content. And now it's going to continue being like this for another year without actually having any new content. And that's going to be uh, just a bit hard for content creators, for like players as well. Uh, but more importantly, it's going to be hard for content creators, even more than streamers. And then it's going to be so boring for players as well. But about Motive Studios, uh, to be honest, I have no background on playing Star Wars games. But I've played the Dead Space remake recently. And I have to be honest, that game is really a great game. I mean, based on my experience with the previous Dead Space, the original Dead Space 1, the Dead Space remake was just a fantastic game. 
I have to say they have my respect because they remade this Dead Space perfectly. I mean, there was nothing wrong with it. The game was awesome. It just had some performance issues on PC that never got fixed, like the stuttering issue. You guys can like search on YouTube for this. The stuttering is still a thing. After all the updates, the stuttering is still something to consider with this game. But anyway, the game itself uh, was perfect. And having Motive Studio working on the new game is, I wouldn't say fascinating news, but it's really better than nothing. The more people work on the next game, I believe it's less likely to like having the game ruined by dice again. Because the dice we have right now isn't the dice we used to know. There are so many people working on Battlefield 2042 and the next Battlefield game in dice that literally have no idea what a Battlefield game is. And that is a fact. You can see that in the game. But all in all, for what it's worth, I hope the next Battlefield game actually delivers some Battlefield content. You know, that's all I hope for. And if that means having one more year of no content and nothing going on in 2042, as hard as it can get for a content creator, I'm all in for that. If it basically guarantees that the next Battlefield game is going to be a real Battlefield. But again... I don't think that guarantees anything and we just have to wait and see. So you guys go down in the comment section and let me know what's it like to have season seven as the final season of 2042. And let me know what you think about this. Also, if you have anything to say about Motive Studios, feel free to do that as well in the comment section. And I'll be all ears. So let's have a discussion down there. And until next time, guys, stay cool.